Opportunity for Street View was a project I started a couple of years ago. I started taking my own photos in, in front of them. And then one day, like I looked online and there was one, someone had found it, worked it all out, got it, taken a photo of it with their friends. And that was great, it was like someone got it. I used to be like mad passionate about skating and um, if you skate in the street you learn to sort of see where would be a good spot or how the, a curb or a step would be a really good place to try something. This is really my sort of representation of those spaces that I saw. I guess as, as more people are taking more pictures and people use them to kind of, I don't know, express themselves, the more ideas there are, the more different ways of taking photos there are, the better. You on somewhere like Tumblr or even on Instagram, the amount of creativity that's out there is just, it's just awesome. I started with a smartphone when you jumped in front of the photo, even if you hit the shutter, the camera would delay and you'd miss the shot. I tried out several cameras on this shoot. I mean, they're all kind of different. The D5500 SLR, I mean, I guess that was quite a big step for me, but it's great and I found it quite easy to use. I guess if you really want to nail a shot, that would be the one that I would take, uh, especially you know, somewhere dark, maybe a little bit challenging where the person be moving really fast. Uh, the camera can handle all that stuff, so autofocus, still really sharp when there's lots of motion and even in low light. With a Nikon one, first shot means that you can get 20 shots at one jump, pick the best one, um, which obviously makes it much easier to get them, gives you much more choice. It really changes the way you think about what's possible to do, where I can put the posters up, what kind of conditions I can think about taking photos in, and what kind of output you could get at the end of it. When I used to do it with my smartphone, I'd do like 40 jumps to get one shot, and it would always be a little bit disappointing. I mean, I get this is like absolutely the other end of that, and you can just focus on where you want to put it and how you want to get the jump, and you know what kind of photo you want, and then the camera can, can just make it for you. The most amazing thing is that the camera can just deliver so many high quality shots really, really fast, like without any effort. When people jump in front of it, where you place yourself against them really changes the way the shot works. With the kit, now there's no limitation to that at all. So if I need to put the camera right on the floor, you know, I can just pull the screen out and I can see you know, what the shot's gonna frame up like. Technically, I've learned to take better photos than I would have taken before. That means I can like capture things that I would have missed or it's now easier to, to kind of get more options or to kind of get more shots. If you want to try new things, then it's always worth it. I mean, if you capture people having fun, doing interesting things, trying things, then you know it's always compelling to look at. You know, because you never know what you're going to get out of it.